Adequate oil pressure ensures that all moving parts receive proper lubrication, reducing friction and preventing excessive wear and tear. An engine without oil pressure is about the same as an engine without oil, which means it can result in the same amount of damage and just as fast. The oil pressure sensor plays a key role in this process. It monitors the oil pressure and sends signals to the engine control unit, EECU. The ECU uses this information to make important decisions, such as adjusting fuel delivery, optimizing performance, and triggering warning indicators on the dashboard. This communication between the oil pressure sensor and the EQ is vital for maintaining the engine's health and preventing potential damage. It's important to recognize the symptoms of a faulty oil pressure sensor. Erratic oil pressure readings, flickering warning lights, or a constantly illuminated low oil pressure indicator should not be ignored. These signs could indicate a malfunctioning sensor or potential engine issues that require immediate attention. Moreover, a malfunctioning sensor can even affect the engine control unit's decisions, potentially triggering the engine to enter limp mode. In this mode, the engine's performance is intentionally limited to protect it from further damage. Hey there, I hope you're all doing fantastic and hopefully this video gives you the valuable insights you're looking for. Let's dive right in. The oil pressure sensor in a vehicle operates by utilizing a spring-loaded switch and a diaphragm to keep track of the engine's oil pressure. Here's how it works. The oil pressure sensor, also known as the oil pressure switch, is mounted on the side of the engine block and connected to an oil gallery, which allows oil to flow through the engine. The sensor consists of a diaphragm and a spring-loaded switch. When the engine is turned off, the diaphragm is relaxed and the switch contacts are closed, allowing no electrical current to pass through. Once you start the engine, the oil pump kicks in and begins circulating oil, gradually building up oil pressure. As the pressure increases, it acts on the diaphragm, exerting force on it. When the oil pressure rises above a specific threshold, usually around 4.3 psi, the force from the pressure surpasses the spring pressure in the switch. Consequently, the switch contacts open, breaking the electrical circuit. As a result, the low oil pressure indicator light on the dashboard turns on, alerting you to the low oil pressure condition. However, if the oil pressure drops below the set limit, Below 4.3 psi, the diaphragm releases pressure from the springs, causing them to close the switch contacts again. This completes the electrical circuit, turning off the low oil pressure indicator light. In essence, the oil pressure sensor keeps a constant check on the oil pressure in your engine. If it falls below the set limit, it activates the low oil pressure indicator light to notify you of a potential issue. Low pressure warning light coming on and off randomly. If you notice the low oil pressure warning light flickering or turning on and off unpredictably, it could be a sign of a malfunctioning oil pressure sensor. The sensor may be providing inconsistent readings, causing the warning light to behave erratically. Low oil pressure warning light constantly on. A faulty oil pressure sensor can also result in the low oil pressure warning light remaining illuminated continuously, even if the oil pressure is actually within the normal range. This persistent warning light indicates a potential problem with the sensor. Limp mode activation. In some cases, when the EQ receives faulty signals from the oil pressure sensor, it may engage limp mode as a precautionary measure. Limp mode limits the engine's power and performance to protect it from potential damage. If your vehicle experiences reduced power, restricted RPM, or limited throttle response along with the low oil pressure warning light, it could be due to a bad oil pressure sensor. Inaccurate oil pressure gauge readings. A bad oil pressure sensor can cause the oil pressure gauge to display inaccurate readings. The gauge may show excessively high or low oil pressure levels even when the actual pressure is normal. These misleading readings can cause confusion and make it difficult to gauge the true condition of the engine's oil pressure. The typical cost of replacing an oil pressure sensor ranges from $150 to $200. This estimate covers the cost of parts which can range from $10 to $100 to $100 for $100 for $100 for one hour of labor. Replacing the oil pressure sensor is generally a straightforward job without any anticipated complications, so the mentioned price range should be applicable in most locations. However, it's worth noting that if you choose to have the replacement done at a dealership, the cost may be increased by around 30. In this video format, it's a bit tricky to explain the process of replacing an oil pressure sensor but you can find a helpful video tutorial in the description below this text. It breaks down the steps using easy, 
Thunderstand language and shows you exactly how to replace the sensor.